guys with a review for my whole family about IXL Learning. So this is an online um, learning program that has an app. It also has a website. I'm reviewing the full annual membership for all subjects. Some of the subjects are going to be from second grade through eighth grade. And then they have math, which is available from preschool on up, as well as language arts, which is available from preschool on up. This also includes Spanish. So I'm going to include some snippets of my children working with this program, and then we'll be back with our thoughts on how we all enjoyed it. All right. So, Belle, what yes. you think so far? It is cool. Okay. So right now he is in social studies, and he is doing the continents and oceans set. What do you like about the program so far? I like how it gives you a visual. Is it like making you like write it down? Like they're like, like writing it down, having to write it down on a piece of paper or trying to like look it up in like a big map or something. I like how it just gives you a small visual. Okay. Do you feel like the um, positive things that it gives you, letting you know when you got something right? Yes. Or assisting you when you get something wrong and having the education part of it. Do you think that's helpful? Yes. Okay. I like, and I also like how it gives you a second chance on some of the questions. Oh, yeah. Alrighty. Which pen is longer? Look at you, princess. Challenge zone. Which piece of wood is the shortest? Which piece of wood is the shortest? Good job. Which fish is longer? Which fish is longer? Good job. Which arrow is the longest? Which is the longest arrow? Do we have that before? We have not had an arrow before at the house. Well, you better go, girl. Which school bus is longer? Look at you! Princess, you did that in two minutes. I'm so proud. I didn't even know you knew how to do that, girl. Yay, look at you. 97. 97. Are those my minutes? So we have Bam Bam working on this right now. He's really Are those my it. minutes? That's, that's how many minutes you've done this. That? Mm -hmm. I know that. I know that. You know that? Okay. 98. Look at you. I'm so proud of you. Three plus two. 99. Okay. One plus four. 100. Yay. <laughs> I'm so proud of you. You're awesome. You know that? You are so awesome. You earned three medals, and this is saying you practiced today for 30 minutes, and you have three skills that you mastered, and you got two prizes. That's what that means. Good job. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Okay. Guys, right, this is my mini me princess, so I'm going to let her tell you what she likes about the program. So, princess, um, did you like doing the online program? My favorite. Tell me what you tell me what your favorite part was. My favorite is when I put all the butterflies in the white picture. Okay, so you like doing the butterfly game. So they have a game on there where you can take pictures and you can drag them up. And she liked doing that. What else did you like doing? Put all the dinosaurs in the wall in the white picture. What about when you had to learn letters? Look right here. What about when you had to learn letters? Um, Do you think that was easy or hard? Not hard. Not hard? Okay. Um, did you learn any new letters? No. No? Okay. Did you learn any new numbers? No. No? Okay. Did you learn new games? No. No, of course not. You know, because she she knows everything. Come on now. You know she didn't learn nothing new. Okay. Tell me what your name is, sir. Bam Bam. Okay, Bam Bam. So tell us your favorite part of the program. I got you. You're not going to fall. You good? 
when, when I answer questions. Okay. When you answer the questions in math or you answer the questions in the reading part? Math. Math. Okay. That, so you like doing the math the most? Yes. Um, did you play new games? Yes. Okay. Um, what about the reading part? Did you learn any new words? No. No? Okay. What about learning the capital letter, the uppercase and the lowercase letters? Did you learn how to do that? You like playing that game? Yeah, but I don't know the upper case, uh -huh. I mean upper case, but not the lower case. I think that other kids your age should do this program? Yeah, I think yeah. so. But... All, right. All right, guys. So here is the big one. He's 11 now. Okay, look at this. Look at this. Only a few more years. All right. Tell me your thoughts about the program, what you liked about it. So what I liked about it, I liked about how when you get a question wrong, you may get it wrong then, but then it gives you a couple more questions, then it brings back that question that you answered. So it gives you another shot instead of just get, asking you one question, then you get it wrong, and then not ask you that question again. It gives you another chance okay. to work on. Okay, what did you think about the explanations down at the bottom? I like the explanations. Okay. On how like where the, like the origin of the word came from, or where the origin of that theory came from, or where it came from. Period. Okay. Uh, which subject out of all? Because you actually had access to every subject. The little ones did not. Out of all the subjects, which one was your favorite to work with? Um, my favorite one would have to be number one social studies, and then number two would have to be math. Okay, and social studies, what did it cover? So in social studies, it, it covered the continents, the seven continents and the seven oceans. And it also covered, it also covered how to spell this, the continents and oceans too. Okay, now you got to do diagnostic testing, a little bit of that. And what did you think about that process? Well, I thought, I thought it was cool how you were able to like, pick which direction you want it to go, like, like, this is actually an example, like, say, say, um, say on one side, it had, do you, do you want to do math, and on the other hand, and, and on the other side, it has social studies, and you can pick which, which, um, which side you want to do next, so which question you want to do next. Okay, what about the option to where if you didn't understand it, you can click, I don't know this yet, did you like to have that option? Yeah, I like to have that, because not everybody knows it. You, even genius, even geniuses don't know everything. Okay. Would you recommend this for kids your age? Yes, I recommend. Yes, I recommend this. Okay. Okay. Do you prefer the website or the app? Um, I prefer the app because I've never really had problems with the app. That's true. Sometimes the website would take a while. Yeah. Because it takes longer on the website to like download. So. Okay. Any other thoughts? Um, I liked it. All right. All right. Thank you, son. Okay. So my turn to share my thoughts on the program. Um, first of all, I definitely prefer the app over the website. The diagnostic testing, I did not see it on the app. I only saw it on the website. Maybe I was missing something. I did have my son go through that and he actually did like it. Usually he's not a big fan of taking tests, but he went through most of it and it was able to give him recommendations on where he should start because there's so many choices and so that narrowed it down for him. You know, you don't need to go back over this because you know that you start around here and he was able to pick from there where he wanted to go. So that was good for him. I like that it had the Spanish option. We have not reviewed Spanish in quite some time. So having those Spanish lessons was great. I love that it had the certificates option. You can print the certificates out. You can just show them to the kids. That's what I did. Um, I, you will see screenshots of the program and all of that on the blog. Um, on the blog also, you'll find extra details about this program. But I really wanted you guys to hear from the children, to see the children and just understand how they used it, all right? So for more information about our day-to-day -day on how we use this program, for more detailed information from not just me, from the Homeschool Review Crew, you will click on the link below and that will have the link to my blog post. And from there, you can read my thoughts as well as click on the link to read the thoughts of other reviewers from the Homeschool Review Crew. This program, I think, has been very helpful in our household and I would definitely recommend it because it's a variety of many things. It's not just one subject it's so many subjects and they really liked 
doing it. 15 minutes here, 20 minutes here. You know, if you're out, you can have it on your phone. I love the app aspect. I really wish a lot of companies would definitely look into putting money into their apps and making them usable. Even if our internet service was bad, because we live in the country, we could still access that app better than the website. We, we had no issues. It was running so smooth, all right? So that's all I have for you guys. Again, check below for all those wonderful links. Thank you so much for tuning in. I will see you in the next